Globally, there is a drive to improve access to science, engineering, technology and mathematics due to the fast and evolving influence technology plays in people's everyday lives. Sadly, access to science education is more limited in the northern part of the country due to human factors. In an effort to correct the trend, the Adolescent Girls Initiative for Learning and Empowerment, Agile, a World Bank-assisted project, in collaboration with the Kaduna State Government, is supporting female secondary school students in the state within this space, with a focus on robotics and design as a key tool for expressing the vocational abilities within the growing technological and industrial economy. With the implementation partner, Kabara Community Development Initiative, about 130 female students and 70 teachers from selected science secondary schools across Kaduna are being trained under the program. Agile's approach to STEM education is a mixture of science, technology, engineering, using numbers, because numbers can tell a story that is very exciting. The focus is really to be in tune with uh, uh, the global direction of education and uh, uh, learning. Um, we're trying to help um, leapfrog and to uh, support learning in science, technology, engineering, maths and design uh, to help young people assimilate um, all the necessary skill sets they need uh, to advance in the world that we are today. By allowing the students and even the teachers to learn STEM education using robots and designs, the organizers believe that it will trigger their critical thinking skills and instill a passion for innovation. The idea here is to help support their learning in the schools and to teach them um, physical skills that they can use to propagate uh, their basic science knowledge to improve their, their energy um, access to themselves. The program targets girls who, by virtue of their social standing, do not have any opportunity or means to explore STEM education. Therefore, introducing such girls to STEM education at a young age is expected to give them equal opportunities to pursue and thrive in STEM careers later on in their lives. I learned how to, um, how to construct hydro uh, energy using water to power electricity and how to make, um, we use um, the building blocks, modernized building blocks to do that and we also use the modernized building block to make a um, car using um, solar energy, empowering it to move and using um, battery to empower it to move also. Atat is here to help me achieve my knowledge and to tell me that I have the power and the confidence to stand in front of everyone to speak without big fear. We have some exposure with regard to uh, implementing STEM education in delivering our content to the children. And uh, also regarding the robotics, we are exposed to some certain things regarding robotics and artificial intelligence. STEM careers are exciting and going forward it's expected the skills acquired will consequently shape the minds of these girls, especially in the areas of science and technology education.